or basic toiletries are things that many of us take for granted. At Cincinnati State, volunteers saw some students who didn't have those things. Angela Ingram shows us how they're trying to fix the problem. So we have uh, meal in a can, instant kind of things. This is dinners for, for people. Within a short time, volunteers have stacked these shelves in the main building of Cincinnati State. There are cans of food. Over here we have uh, toiletries, everything from shampoo, hand sanitizer, toothpaste and toothbrushes. Hunter Campbell yeah. moved from Washington to go to school camp. here. It's his first semester and he had no problem jumping in to help with the surge cupboard. Uh, we do a lot of things. Uh, volunteers mostly collect donations. Uh, we sort donations, check things for expiration dates, make sure everything's quality. The nonprofit food pantry will be open to students Wednesdays and Thursdays and it's free. Once a month, students can take three days worth of food and toiletries. The idea is to make sure they get what they need and they can continue with their studies. Food insecurity is a barrier to a lot of things, but um, majorly it's a barrier to education. Uh, so sometimes students who can't get access to food can find that gets in the way of them seeking you know, higher education or just in the way of their studies doing things like homework. It also shows that we're in complete alignment with the community. The poverty initiative is something that's of great concern throughout the Cincinnati area and so now we're doing something on campus and we want to branch out and help our community. The pantry is a way for students and staff to support each other and to make sure that these students are successful with their education. It's wonderful. It's the type of culture that we're trying to build and expand upon. It shows us that we can do even more bigger, greater things. At Cincinnati State, Angela Ingram, Local 12 News. And the pantry opens for the first time tomorrow between 4 and 6 p.m. And if you'd like to help with donations, we have contacts on local12.com. What a nice effort. Isn't it? Yes. yes.